many people in the audience are developers here. And a question that I know has come up internally as people you know, think about uh, how AI is developing is which parts of the software engineering job will AI take over? Um, and what becomes more important in a world where we have autonomous agents being able to do, do a lot of software engineering? Yeah, um, so probably like many people here, I, I read with great interest uh, Steve Yege's blog post a couple of months ago, uh, Revenge of the Junior Developer. Uh, he, had some, uh, he had some similar blog posts. Uh, he had some similar blog posts around that. He actually uh, came in to visit us even. Um, uh, um, uh, uh, and, and that laid out, I think, the vision of where things are going, maybe, maybe even better than I could, which is that we're gradually, go, we're gradually going to more and more autonomy of the models, right? We had this phase where you would do basically autocomplete. Now there's this thing that I guess people have called vibe coding. That, then we're going more to kind of like you can dispatch the agents to, to do things. And I think with, with Claude Code, we're going to go, go more in the direction of, you know, you can dispatch the agents to do things. And I'm sure we'll have other product surfaces that, that, that allow you to do that as well. And I think we're, we're heading to a world where a human developer can kind of manage a fleet of agents and say, you go off and do this, you go off and do this, you go off and do that. But, but I think it, continued human involvement is going to be going to be important for the quality control to make sure they do the right things to get the details right.